Hello everybody, it is I, Mr. Charlie Murray, and welcome back to Star Wars The Old Republic Knights of the Fallen Empire Episode 5. The shadows vibrate with my lightsabers. They're scared of my lightsabers, look at that. Ah! And then I put it away. Oh, it's good. Oh, fine. Ah! Ah! Okay, yeah, anyway, <laughs> I just thought that was a bit interesting. It's a weird bug, but... No doubt Bio will fix it in about a year's time. Yeah, yeah. So last time, we crash landed into the depths of Zaku, and here we are in the very murky forests. Very, very murky forests. Uh, and HK could detect something. He could detect a technology... I can't say that word. Technolo technological object. I don't know why I couldn't say that word. Uh, in the distance. Over there. Even though we were over here, because... I left Zaku to do my pack opening video, then I kind of went to the fleet, then I kind of decided to press the play button in my mission log, and it kind of brought me here. So that's fine. Also, I've got a bonus mission to defeat 25 Swamp Beasts for 85,000 experience. I might just do that. I may just do that. Uh, I've sorted out my combat proficiencies. I don't know if I've got the right ones, but I've gone with the ones which I think would be beneficial to me at this moment. Uh, unfortunately, they've changed force charge. It, it seems like they've changed force charge so that I can no longer do it at close quarters. So, I'm going to have to stick with that. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to sort out my rotation at some point, um, but I guess for the time being, until I decide to get around to changing my rotation when, I, when I'm no longer lazy, I will uh, actually sort it out, but I'll just go with any ability for now. What, what, we'll just go with it for now, see what happens. Die you! Ooh, there's a little camp over here. Anything nice over here? Just warming up some eggs, that's nice. That's nice, if they are eggs. I don't really know what they are. Anything in here at all? Just a campfire and some tents. Okay, I've got my random mount button as well. It's cool, so we got this one for now. Get off. Then we have that one. Is that the same one? Okay, and now we've got a different one. And now we've got the banther. <laughs> I love the random mount button. I'm going to be using that from now on forever. Forever. Uh, although the chances of me getting a certain mount, I have no idea because... Yeah, quite a lot of mounts. So that there must be a, at least a hundred here, at least a hundred mounts. So you got like a one in a hundred chance for a mount to appear, and then the same mount appears twice. Well, what are the chances of that? Well, well, what is yeah? What is the chances of a mount appearing twice if you've got a hundred mounts? You'd say, you'd think it was one in one hundred, but no, because that's just the chance of that mount appearing. What's the chance of a mount appearing twice? If you've got a hundred mounts. Dead. Good to know, HK. Good to know. I wonder if you have story. I wonder if the the companions you get in Knights of the Fallen Empire, if they have companion stories. I'd like to hope so, but I kind of feel like they won't. Really? Oh, I'm at 30 frames per second. Oh, that's not nice. Go back up to 60, please. Go back up to 60. Oh. I think because I have high graphics, the game doesn't want to do 60 frames per second. I mean, the video will be 60 frames per second, but the game won't be, if you get my gist. Oh, look. I'm below 50%. They're proving to be a challenge for me. Har har. Why are these acting like they're locked? I really don't know. Well, they're no longer locked now. And then do that. And you did. And I shall take my experience. Thank you very much. Right, let us actually... What the heck is that? An ancient Ignaid. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. we still got a long way to go. We need to make our way around. Get on a mountain, go! Now, I saw a vendor around here. Where is it? It's over here. Now, do you have some stims? Could really do with some stims. Well, you have a war zone adrenal, but that's not really what I'm after. Alright. Only because I put my sims in my cargo hold and I can no longer find them now. I don't know where they are. So we'll just have to go with it. Righto, there's some enemies guarding whatever this is. Hmm, I wonder what it is. We shall find out. Protection services online. 
what now? Has achieved deafness. What did you say? Protection services online. Okay, that's fine. Ooh, something blue. Be something nice, please. Something nice. Uh, prototype. Adderscorp offhand saber. And it's slight. It's more powerful than what I've got. Alrighty, let me swap the color crystal around. Hooray! Now I'm even more powerful. Great. Wait, why did you? No, can you go there, please? And then put that there. Pl huh? Did I do that the wrong way around? Huh? You go there. You come out. You go there. You go there. That's what I wanted. Although, actually, strangely, it, it acted more powerful before. Huh. That was strange. Maybe if I swap them around. Oh, I can't. Wait, that acts powerful just on its own. So why do I why do I go down in power and Oh whatever, I'll go with it. I d I don't really know anymore. I don't know anymore. Anyway, what's this? Technological scrap. Let's find out. Uh the scrap does not appear related to the large object that HK fifty five detected. Okay, we need to go to the next one. Which is down there. Alrighty. I love the frame rate on this planet. This planet has amazing frame rates. Alright, let's take a look at this one. Is this the one? The object seems to be a piece of something bigger. Ooh, I wonder what. Maybe, uh... I don't know, what does it look like? It looks like a box. Of some kind. Definitely Zakulian. Zakulian, that sounds weird to say. Zakulian. Uh, well, let's go over here and find out. Go away! Thank you, they went away. And let's see what this one is. The object is ancient and appears to be broken off something much larger. Well, I guess we're getting closer. Uh, wait, we need to go back into the instance? Oh, okay. That's the instance we came out of. Well, instance I came out of when it took me back out. Or is it? I don't really know. I assume it is, but we're going back into it anyway. You're entering your own personal phase. Your groupmates can help you if they enable the social preference to allow access to the same class personal phrases. So you can do this stuff as a group. Alright, that's fine. Well, me and Keevan were planning on doing a... Or Technique Games, I should say. We were planning on doing a cop co series anyway. So that's fine. Oh, hello. Hi. Hello. How are you doing? You okay? Excuse me, let me just... Yeah, alright, you knocked me off. That's that's fine. You are ugly little fellas, aren't you? You really are. Well, they died. Hooray, they died. Uh, any loot? Nope, just some junk. Where am I going? I am go. Oh, I've actually got to make my way around. Try and survive my way around, I should say. They are really ugly, aren't they? But that's, they're not really a challenge. You know, they're getting there. Getting there, Bioware. You're nearly pushing the challenges in this game. You watch, I'll get to like level 65, and then on the very last boss, that'll be where I just suffer. And I just can't get any further. I don't know. Defeat the Swamp Ranker. Oh, dear. Ranker and Swamp don't go well together. Oh, little bugs. Hello. I'm really not paying attention to what my companions are. S yeah, I'm not really paying attention to what my companions are saying because oof, you can't really hear them over the, the the sound effects, and I'm just sort of talking over them. Uh, defeat the swamp ranker. Alrighty, I'll do that, and I'll also do that. Well, that was easier than I thought it was going to be. Alright, and I got some gauntlets. Are they better than what I got? And there you got defense rating, so I'm not gonna wear them. Alrighty. Admiration. It is a great pleasure to witness your skills firsthand, Master. Master? Clarification. Master Benico altered my programming before we secured your release. I am to serve you with the same unexcelled loyalty with which I serve her. In fact, your survival is now my highest priority. If I'm your highest priority, does that mean you obey me above Lana or Koth? Caveat. I cannot accept any order from you that would directly endanger Masters Benico or Vortana. Fair enough. Otherwise, I am at your full disposal. Do I have the authority to modify that programming? Oh. Contradiction. Yes. Oddly enough, you do. 
though I can't imagine why you might wish to. Oh, that's an interesting choice. Hmm. I don't know what to go for here. You know what? Kranatoka's an ass, but he's not that much of an ass. Just curious. No need to change anything. Approval. I am glad you feel that way, Master. Resumption. Shall we continue? We shall, but that was interesting to know. Really was. Damn it, Lana, you... You, you're a flawed person for putting that in. Oh well, let's continue. The meat bags alone. Did you, just, did you just say leave the meat bags alone? What? So, you want them to leave me alone, but you still call me a meat bag. Thanks, HK. Love you too. I really do love the work they've put into this game. The the attention to detail. Just the just I don't know. It just looks beautiful. I mean, yeah, that pops in, fair enough, but, you know, you can't always be perfect. I mean, unless your name's DICE, where you try and strive for perfection, and people want you to go for perfection, you know, it's just, yeah. Ooh, what's this now? Is this the object you picked up on your sensors? Confirmation. Yes, Master. A closer scan suggests that this object has been here for several centuries. And no one's found it in all this time? What is this? Something crash landed. Centuries? Of all the junk out here, you had to find the antique. What do you expect? Visible design elements do not match any from Zakulan culture. Antique or modern? Not from Zakul. Could it be? He doesn't overthink things. Haha! <laughs> Do you have any idea what this is? I don't know, tell me. It looks like some kind of old spacecraft. This is the Gravestone. This Gravestone? was the only ship that ever went up against the Eternal Fleet and won. Do you have any idea how long people have been looking for this thing? And we just happened to stumble upon it. You said this ship went up against the Eternal Fleet and won. But it's rusting in a swamp while the fleet is still around. The fleet is even older than Valkyria. Maybe even older than Zakul. The battles happened centuries ago. Nobody knows the details of the whole war, but every story talks about the Gravestone. One ship with the firepower to take on the Eternal Fleet. This is fate. We get your Outlander. Find exactly the weapon we need. We're going to win this thing, Lana. It's destiny. It's certainly no coincidence, but destiny? I think there's something else going on here. Do you think this is some kind of setup? No, not exactly. I can't quite put my finger on it. I blame the force. Let's have a look inside, huh? Assessment. Nearby signs of animal activity suggest local predators may be using this wreck as a nesting ground. Caution is advised. We'll split up. Deal with any wildlife, then regroup to plan our next move. Uh, I've now got Cough as my companion. Alright, or could I go with anyone, really? Feel better? Nope, I have to be with Koff. I mean, I've had Lana as my companion, and I've had HK. I guess it was Koff's turn now. Alrighty, let's go, Koff. Uh, Gravestone Command Deck, hello. Uh, you will be, again... Let's have you as a tank this time. Why not? Why the hell not? Let's change it up a little bit. Wait, it's been here for centuries, and it's still got a little bit of power. Hmm, surprising. Very surprising. Oh, well, I guess it might be solar power. Yeah, plausible. I can do this all day. Well, hopefully we won't, because we don't have the time. 
Wouldn't mind a challenge now and then. I know. I say the exact same thing. Oh, cough! You were made for me, weren't you? Ellie, sixteen, seventeen, twenty-two. HK sounds like he's having fun. <laughs> I mean, at the same time, I'm having fun as well. I mean, I'm really enjoying the story. I really am. I mean, when Bioware said they are really putting their emphasis on the story, they weren't kidding. They really were, but that's not exactly for the better as well. I mean, the story, don't get me wrong, it's fantastic, but the gameplay is lacking. Like, seriously, I could do any ability, and I haven't died yet. That's my only concern. Okay, sorry, that, tell a lie. I have died, but that was only when I was pushed off. I haven't died from actually taking ability damage yet, I should say. Which is concerning. Maybe they'll change it come future patches, but... I don't know, they've made it a bit too easy. Indeed, it is. I know. You're probably being sarcastic, but it's actually true. Defeat the ancient in a, in a, in a, I can't say that. Ichneid Guardian. Alright. Well, is it really ancient? Because I managed to kill one before. Yep, I'll just uh, keep running. <laughs> It'll be an easy kill anyway. Again, me and Koth are barely taking any damage. Oh well. Oh, hello! You got some friends. Now we're taking damage. That's fine. There we go. I killed your babies. I'm sorry. I'm not. And that's you down. Oh, bloody hell, you got a lot of babies around you. Whoa! Don't worry, I'm trying to help you. I'm trying to help you. Where that came from? Are they dead? Oh, they all died at once. That's nice. Ooh, what's this now? Some braces. Uh, worse than what I've got. All right, that's fine. Uh, and I'll pick this up, please, please. Thank you. And there's the airlock. What shall we find behind it? Let's find out. Let's cough. The Endless Swamp. After the damage you inflicted, they couldn't have made a safe landing anywhere else. And if they didn't make a safe landing? We'll know soon enough. Sky Troopers, sweep the area. Focus on regions with high metallic sensor readings. I love how you get to see what's going on elsewhere. That's I nice. I oversaw security in the Carbonite prison. I... I humbly submit myself to answer for this failure. Prepare for your life to end. Sister! I didn't like his answer. Do you like anyone's answer? I mean, you tried to attack me just for being a force apparition. I mean, come on now. You knew you couldn't hurt me. Well, hurt, kill me, you know. But so you still did it. So ship has been here for a thousand years? More? Right. It's amazing that it's in such good condition, considering. Judging by the damage I've seen, the stories are true. Whoever built the gravestone scuttled it themselves after the Eternal Fleet was defeated. It wasn't shot down. The fleet was defeated, but not destroyed. Valkorion brought it back under his own control more than a century ago. Exactly. The Eternal Fleet is totally automated. Nobody knows who first built it, and every theory is crazier than the last. Renegades left behind after a successful droid revolution. Representatives of an entire race of droids from somewhere beyond the edge of the known galaxy. Like I said, crazy stuff. But no matter where it came from, the Eternal Fleet is practically unstoppable. And Arkin controls every single ship from the throne. If Valkorion has had this unstoppable fleet for more than a century, why didn't he use it to help the Sith Empire defeat the Republic? We can only theorize. Uh, if the war was just part of a ritual to make the Emperor truly immortal, perhaps using the fleet would have interfered somehow. Regardless, we have many other things to discuss. I owe you five years' worth of explanations. Yes, you do. And I'm gonna need some parts to get this thing moving again. Locating supplies and fresh water would also be wise. Wait, you're actually gonna try and move this? Oh, okay. Well, I'm going to help Lana find supplies first. I'll help you find what we need, Lana. Very well. Assertion. 
I will begin a patrol pattern to ensure that no enemy forces report our position. Alrighty, so for now, we shall leave the episode here. Uh, we need to take readings for groundwater, wherever that will be. It will be outside, most likely. Um, oh, outside the phase. Oh, we got a long way to travel then. So anyway, for the time being, thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. It's getting really good, and I will see you next time. And a farewell to you.